My name is Lester Karpless, and in this session we'll be exploring some of the many ways that you can enhance your app control with a wireless foot switch. In the early 2000s, the tablet computer and the PDF file came together to create an opportunity for musicians to display their music in digital format. The big challenge, however, was the fact that you still had to leave your instrument to turn the page of music. To solve that problem, AirTurn came up with a wireless foot switch that would allow you to continue to play your music and not have to interrupt to turn a page. It wasn't long before gigging musicians of all types were getting in on the action of using a foot switch. AirTurn provided developers an SDK to embed foot switch support. And with this, the first apps to allow you to scroll lyrics or tablature were born. And soon, even more features were supported, including backtrack start and stop, metronome start and stop, transposition, and more. Today, over 100 apps support the wireless foot switch to do all kinds of activities. More musicians are building out their home recording studio. What could be more convenient than arming your record button hands-free? Do-it-yourself looping and adding in effects on the fly just got easier with the press of a foot switch. From GarageBand to Ableton, assigning shortcut keys to your air turn foot switches is a cinch. And if you need more switches, just connect a couple more air turns. In 2018, AirTurn began supporting MIDI over Bluetooth for all of its products. This was a game changer because now you could add control switching to your rig through any computer. In 2020, Woody Master introduced a Bluetooth adapter and now you can connect your AirTurn and send MIDI commands to your keyboard or any other standalone MIDI device. With this, no computer is required. MIDI commands can be programmed through the AirTurn Manager. Since all AirTurn foot switches have the same feature set, you get to decide the feel you want and how many switches you need. Just like shoes, your foot switch has to have the right feel and response. The PED Pro is a non-tactile switch that responds to a firm press or tap. It works great on a floor surface with a hard sole shoe, but not so well on a carpet or with bare feet. Our most popular foot switch is the Duo. It has a switch that will practically last forever. It is silent, but also tactile, so you can feel the movement under your foot. The 3 16 inch thick polymer blend will never break, and is designed to outlast a mechanical switch by millions of presses. You can also get the same foot switch in the Quad, which has four switches instead of two. If you're looking for something more traditional, check out the BT200S series. These stainless steel switches are still quiet, but with a longer stroke for a more solid feel. You can get the same switch style in a two, a four, or a six switch version. Every AirTurn product comes with a rechargeable lithium polymer battery. The lithium battery on AirTurn devices lasts between 150 and 200 hours between charges. This tiny battery will last two to five years and is a blessing to keep disposable batteries out of landfills. And we'll flash you with a red light when it's time to recharge. And you can plug into any USB charger for a top up. Let's dig in to the software features of every AirTurn controller. These are there for a multitude of different uses and operating systems. There are three protocols available on every AirTurn switch. You access them through the mode button. First, there is Air Direct or Mode 1, with only specific applications that support it. All action in Air Direct mode is programmed in the supporting application. This provides you the luxury of never having to think about what you're doing with the air turn and leave everything up to the app. An important feature of the Air Direct mode is that you have full access to the keyboard in all your applications. Our second protocol is available in modes two through six, which include navigation, 
keys like arrow keys, page up, page down. Also in this group are special consumer report commands that can take a picture, change the volume, or go to the next or previous song or use the foot switch to issue a mouse click. Check out all the available keystroke commands in our manuals at manual.airturn.com. And finally, our third protocol is MIDI, which is supported under mode seven on all air turns. With this mode, you can send MIDI commands to your apps or to any instrument that supports MIDI over Bluetooth. Are you ready for some cool features? Download the AirTurn Manager from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store and we can update all kinds of things on your AirTurn device. Perhaps one of the greatest features of the AirTurn Manager is the ability to update your AirTurn device to the latest and greatest version. Another important feature you might like to use is setting the timeout before the unit powers down. It comes set default for two hours but you may want to set it for longer or even shorter. You can also change the switch action to emulate momentary, pulse, latching, or command. You can program each keyboard code for each switch and even have modifiers added to do codes like Control S or Command C. You can also send special codes such as volume, camera, video, or any other command that can be generated from a keyboard. You can also change what MIDI controls or notes are sent. Another really cool feature is the AirTurn open and close pairing method. We don't know any other Bluetooth device that does this. This is really important for members of a band who all have AirTurn devices and want to make sure that they only pair to their device. Open pairing is how your AirTurn comes set up by default. In this mode, it will immediately connect to any open Bluetooth pairing. The downside is, is that if you paired to your phone already and you go to pair to your tablet, the phone already has the connection. With closed pairing, your device will always pair to your air turn and won't attempt to pair to any other device. However, if you do want to pair to another device, you have to remove the pairing by holding the power button for 8 seconds. And of course, don't forget to remove the pairing from the host device. A couple other interesting features of the AirTurn Manager include debounce control and power versus performance. Debounce control helps set the timing for when it will receive a second input. This is especially important for the nervous player who might hit the foot switch two times too quickly. Every musician and Audio Pro user can benefit from adding an AirTurn to their tech kit. Reasonably priced, built to last and backed by a two-year warranty, order yours today.